going to do here, build a barrel vaulted ceiling. And then we're going to finish it off with beadboard underneath. And it looks, it looks beautiful. It's very striking. It's beautiful. It's rich looking. And we're going to do it in an hour here. So, you know, you can take a whole day to do it and, and charge lots of money, but it's, it's very, very easy. And I'll just go over some of the principles. First, we're working with a circle. It's about the best I can do. Halfway through the circle, that's the diameter. And half of the diameter going one way, that's the radius. Anytime we take a piece of the circle, doesn't matter where it is, down here, up here, and cut it off, that's a segment of, the, of an arc. So that's what we're going to be dealing with, just those, those, those general principles, and, and that's really all you need to know about circles to do it. That, and you have a construction master. You can do this, you can do this by hand. I mean, we, you know, write it out. It can be done. But just using this, you punch in a couple of buttons and it tells you everything that you need to know very easily. So what the premise here is we have an entryway coming into a house. There's a reason why I'm a builder, not an architect. This is it. So nobody laugh at my drawings or I'm leaving. <laughs> anyway, there's my, my entryway with the little roof going across it. Okay. And what we want to do is put a barrel vaulted ceiling in here. Just make it a nice Nice striking entryway, so when you walk in, you see this round wood finished barrel vaulted ceiling. And it's, well, ours is going to be six feet deep, and the width is 80 inches from here to here. And that's what we have to work with. So looking back at this, can anybody tell me? What size circle we should be working with? What's the radius or diameter? Any guesses? Any 80 inches? That's what most people would think. Thank you. <laughs> Someone stood up. You do an 80 inch diameter radius? Diameter. So we have 160 inch radius going across there. So if we took, let me use another color so you can get an idea here. We took an 80 inch radius, so it's wide as it is low, you know, 80 inch diameter or radius? No, 80 inch radius. Is, anyway, it's going to go something like that. What we need to do is find out what's the radius of this circle right here. And we're going to take out that segment of it. So we have 80 inches wide. And let's say the highest we can go, because of the roof there, is 24 inches. So those are the only two numbers we need to know. We have an 80 inch width from here to here, and we can't go any higher than 24 inches because we'll be up past the roof. I entered the 80 inch run, the 24 inch height, pushed the arc button, and it gave me the radius. So I need a circle with a radius of, oh, here's the center, three, nine and five sixteenths and then i just take a segment off of that and that will work that's what i'm looking for